guys, I'm Tom with CellPhoneTrek.com. I have with me here Russ Warner from ContentWatch.com. .com, correct? Sure. Sure, it'll work. With Content Watch. And what is Content Watch for the viewers at home that don't know? Uh, Content Watch is the world leader in content filtering. Basically, when you're in a browser, you can keep kids or employees from going to websites you don't want them to see. Such as, you know, keeping employees off Twitter or Facebook. You could do that, yeah. Or Playboy.com. Or Playboy.com. Inappropriate yeah. sites that maybe you don't want potential clients to see your employees on. Exactly. Gambling sites, alcohol, tobacco, weapons, all of that stuff. All right. Uh, do you have a demonstration of how to uh, sure. you know, set up Content Watch? What we're trying to do, though, at this show is that we're showing off our iOS version. So okay. this is an iPad. This product works on iPhones and iPads. And basically, we've created a browser that you replace Safari with. And you come in. I just want to show you that it is a browser. So here's my Google page. You can go ahead and search for any, any website you want to, but I've automated this to go a little bit faster. All right. So I'm going to take you to Coors.com. But, unfortunately, we have a filter on here to block you from alcohol sites. I'll take you to Playboy.com. But, unfortunately, You've blocked it's blocked it. because we block pornography. If, however, you go to a web page, let's say we do a, a Yahoo search, Google search for the term, oops, hang on, for the term breast. Breast is a tricky topic. Why? Because breast can be something benign, such as, let me show you this, we have uh, the search results for breast cancer. That's not really a... a an objectionable site. So if we go there, we basically analyze the content of the page on the fly. We'll show you the content here because it's not objectionable. If we go back though, go back, you'll see that other of the search results include topics like breast. Now I'm not exactly sure what's on that page. And wikis and blogs are usually websites that are not policed by anybody. But since we analyze on the fly, when I try to go to that page, you get blocked because it does have stuff that you don't want your kids to see or your employees. You're, help, you're helping block and do things that other filter content providers just don't do. That's exactly because right. Because they don't have the capabilities to do it, but you've created something that fixes that. Exactly. So this is great, and it's manageable for iPhones, for iPads. Even on the Android system, yep. we do have, we won't show the demo, but it is available here on the Galaxy Tab and other Android devices that come soon, right? Exactly. Just any Android. That's right. Android devices, too, to say, I've got my Motorola Atrix. or tabs, exactly. So, and I'm sure Blackberry's to come soon. Perhaps. Perhaps. We'll see in the future. Uh, well, it looks really great. Thanks. Is there a cost to this? Uh, we're planning to go to market for $4.99 on the market or in the iTunes store. So for $4.99, giving you the peace of mind and security that your employees, but more importantly, your children, are protected from obscene and lewd content that they could stumble across or, God forbid, they're searching out themselves. Exactly. And some employees are like children. Yes, they are. They are. There are some employees that are like children that I know. At, that I really, really know. So, Russ, you've been Thanks great. Thanks for your time, Tom. Thank you for showing off this You're great welcome. device. We'll have an application review of this up shortly on CellPhoneTrek.com. I want to say thanks again. We're here at the Pepcom event during CTIA 2011. Check out some more of our other videos. And thanks for watching.